Have you ever pondered the enduring legacy of one life to live? How a soap opera, a genre often dismissed as trivial, could etch such a deep mark onto the canvas of television history? One Life to Live was more than just a daytime drama. It was a beacon of innovation, a trailblazer that dared to explore social issues often shied away from by its contemporaries. Yet, the show's brilliance is not merely anecdotal. Its significance is reflected in the numerous awards that serve as testament to its quality and influence. The Daytime Emmy Awards, the pinnacle of recognition in the world of soap operas, showered One Life to Live with accolades throughout its run. The show won the coveted Outstanding Drama Series Award in both 1994 and 2002, a testament to its enduring appeal and consistency. Not to be outdone, the show's actors also took home their fair share of individual honors. Erica Slezak, who played the iconic Victoria Lord, won an unprecedented six daytime Emmys for Outstanding Lead Actress. Roger Howarth and Susan Haskell also clinched the Outstanding Lead Actor and Outstanding Lead Actress awards respectively, making their indelible mark in the soap opera universe. But the accolades don't stop there. One Life to Live also received the prestigious GLAAD Media Award for Outstanding Daily Drama in 2009, acknowledging the show's groundbreaking portrayal of LGBT characters and storylines. Now the question arises, why should such an iconic piece of television history fade into obscurity? There is a growing movement of ardent fans and television enthusiasts alike, advocating for the preservation of one life to live. They understand the value of this gem, the need for present and future generations to have access to it, to learn from it, to appreciate it. This is not simply about nostalgia. It's about recognizing the importance of one life to live in the grand narrative of television history. It's about ensuring this soap opera, a show that pushed boundaries and won hearts, continues to live on, not just in memory, but in the accessible digital realm. So, join the chorus of voices calling for one life to live to be made available for streaming. Help preserve a piece of television history that dared to be more than just a soap opera, because one life to live deserves to be remembered, celebrated, and most importantly, watched. One life to live was not just a soap opera, it was a launchpad for many successful careers in TV and movies. Actors like Tommy Lee Jones, Lawrence Fishburne, Ryan Phillip, and Marsha Cross all got their start on this groundbreaking series, each going on to have illustrious careers in the entertainment industry. From Oscar wins to critically acclaimed performances in both film and television, these actors owe their successful careers to the solid foundation they received on One Life to Live. It's not just a piece of television history, it's a star maker. When the final episode of One Life to Live aired, it left a void in the soap opera genre that remains unfilled. Efforts to replace the iconic show in its coveted time slot on ABC have been short-lived and unremarkable. One Life to Live was unique, its blend of captivating storytelling, compelling characters, and trailblazing social narratives set it apart. Despite countless attempts, no show has been able to replicate the success and lasting impact of One Life to Live. It wasn't just a soap opera, it was a phenomenon. Should Disney sell its soap operas to a company that can preserve their legacy? Shows like One Life to Live, All My Children and Passions have left indelible marks on television history. Their legacy, rich with groundbreaking storytelling and unforgettable characters, deserves to be honored and preserved. A potential sale could lead to a revival of these iconic soaps, their continued broadcast or even remastered releases. The right company could ensure these soaps are remembered, celebrated and most importantly, watched by future generations.